Hey, what's going on all you ghouls and ghosts out there? My name is Mike Macabra, and welcome to the graveyard. As always, if you like what you see, like, subscribe, comment, share the video, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more of my reaction videos, Friday Night Frights, Mouthing Off with the Mike Macabra, or whatever else I'm doing on this channel. But on tonight's episode, we have another Reviews and Reactions, excuse me, special episode of Reviews and Reactions with Trailer Tuesdays and Thursdays. Yes, indeed. We're coming back to some more Indonesian trailers. We're going to be reacting to Satan's Slave 2 Communion. Link to that original video will be down in the description box. Feel your feeling pleasure at your leisure. And this request comes to us by Ryan Minded. Thank you again for that lovely, lovely request. Always going into this blind with my off-the-cuff comments. I won't recognize it because I know I've never seen it. Uh, I haven't seen anything Indonesian other than on this channel. So, yeah, no more ghouling around. Let's check it out. All right, ghouls and ghosts. Satan Slave 2. Communion official trailer and Shudder. Uh, I, I don't think I've ever seen the Shudder channel. <laughs> The strings in the background are very intense. That kind of scared me. Interesting. Let me collect my, collect my thoughts a little bit. See you in the review section. All right. Ghouls and ghosts. That was Satan's Slave 2. Communion. Link to that original video will be down in the description box. For your feeling pleasure. At your leisure. And again, this request comes to us by Ryan Minded. Thank you again for that lovely, lovely request. Now, I have no idea what's going on with these uh, these Satan's slaves, because I've never seen the first one. But from what I can gather, apparently this father figure uh, has this briefcase, not a briefcase, but like a bag and all that, that he does what I would guess unholy work on, these dead bodies... And maybe that makes them a vessel for Satan and or demons. And they become possessed. And I assume that's what's chasing all the little children around. That's what I can gather. Um, that being said, if that's the case, that is 
these, the first one and the second one will be definitely something that I would like to uh, check out for sure. I absolutely love everything to do with uh, Satanism, possession, demons, and demonic stuff, the occult. I find that stuff absolutely fascinating. The tension was very high. I mean, even parts where, like, I, w I was focusing, focusing so much on the music and the imagery that that little <laughs> uh, thunder crack scared me. Like, and the other stuff really didn't. Like, when uh, that white girl in the white dress appeared on the... Uh, on the stairs didn't really do it for me, but the the background crackling of the the thunder and all that, yeah, that made me jump of all things. So it 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 fit really well with the story. Like again, I don't know what's happening with the story, and with the headphones, you can really feel the the noise bass it was very low, very bassy, and it really added to it. But taking everything into account score I'm going to give this four skulls out of five absolutely happy with that score for all the reasons I just stated but I think that's going to be it for this episode of reviews and reactions as always if you like what you saw like subscribe comment share the video hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more of my reaction videos Friday Night Frights mouthing up with Mike Macabra or what else I'm doing on this channel but as always, ghouls and ghosts, stay scared. Ah! Ah!